Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, nice strike landed there by what? Good one, two. Blocking all the shots coming towards his head. Nice punch by what? He's looking for that elbow. Chris Weidman with some vicious body shots. I would agree with you there, Joe. These body strikes are really gonna start to take their toll. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Effective strike there by Diaz. Huge block there. Big punch. There's a good right hook there by Nick. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Fainting. Weidman gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Whoa! Huge shots there. This could be it right here. Big shots. Straight punch. Oh. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. He's hurt. He's in big, oh. big trouble. He's out. He's and out that's going to do it. What power that guy has in his hands. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. Joe landed flush, and I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. No traces, underestimate the boy Ali, you headless necklace, that's a fashion statement. Yeah. Sweat pouring, let him mix with a gasoline, I say the spark was a fair warning. Yeah. Look to the other side of the world, I can barely go and fix in the new foreign. Why yeah. well, I get up, then get locked, and I'm on too quick, gonna hit it. Pack one more for the mausoleum, I pack out shows in the corner, see your pants up, get a sailor. Young Juno in the building, stand in procedure, rap on the geek, cause they want me to rest in peace, but they know that I'm undefeated. Yeah. 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 I know, yeah, I'll be undefeated. undefeated. Stacking with, stacking though, undefeated. Everybody only want me for the crown. But I never lose and never let you stop. All right, straight ahead, it's a light heavyweight matchup between Alexander Gustafson and Daniel Cormier. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Gustafson is 31, Cormier is 38. Gustafson is six inches taller. He will have a seven inch reach advantage. All right, now for the particulars inside the octagon of Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a wrestler, only a professional record of 22 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205. You ready? You ready? First round underway. Fainting. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Oh, went to the switch kick there. Nice job by DC. Tags him with the uppercut. Gustafson gets hit with a kick. That looked like it hurt you. He's doing a very good job of parrying and blocking all the shots that are coming towards his head. They're both landing bombs on each other. Showing the punch. Gustafson's shot is blocked. Well, he gets cracked to the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You've got to get that head off the center line. Blocks the shot. All of those are blocked. Kick to the body by Cole. Uppercut to the head instead of 
blocked by Alexander Gustafson. Faints with the punch, showing that punch. Good punch. Back and forth we go. Under three minutes to go in round one. Slips the punch. Oh, the straight hand lands flush to the body by Alexander Gustafson. Oh! Finds his range with the jab. Good defense there. Oh, Huge that is shot. a big hook. We'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, very nice. Hard straight punch. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Oh. Daniel's hurt. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Oh! Good short punch there. Body kick, look at that. He's blocking all the shots coming towards his head. How about that shin? Oh, how about the switch kick there by Cormier? Finds a home for that left hook. Oh, straight right. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Eight down a 10th plate, and it's good. Nice punch there by DC. Twenty seconds to go in round one. And he lands a hammer fist. Good shot to the head. That hurt sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's gonna want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Oh! Whoa, he nailed him. He's got him hurt here. Oh, big left. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Good job there, keeping his hands up, obviously protecting that cut. There's a nice knee to the body. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Corbin. And right behind it. Back and forth we go. Oh! He's in a lot of trouble. Oh, very nice. Gigantic kicks. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Oh, high-level defense there. The hook shot is blocked by DC. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Constantly a moving target. Oh, Looked look like at it that. did start him a little bit. This could be it right here. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Look at the bruising on his torso. Big body punch. Well, DC's like glue. I mean, he just sticks onto you. Oh, he's keeping busy here in the clinch. Knee to the body. He hurt him again! He's gotta be careful there. Don't rush in. Coming, it's blocked. Oh, nice jab by Kumi. Lands to the body. He's checking every single one of those. 
tags him. 15 seconds. Some nice deception there as he lands Oh, the he got tagged again. He's hurt. Oh, wow. And that's the end of round number two. Oh, so there's the horn at the end of the round. He got knocked down near the end of it, saved by the bell. Third round underway. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh! He's stumbling! He's in a lot of trouble. He hurt him with that hook. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Excellent combinations. Just misses there with the left. How about that chin? That one hurt. here, but he's landing some nasty combinations. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. Big Vicious body shot! shot. Body. Tries to pass, but cannot. Huge elbow there, Joe. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Gustafson's cut on his eyebrow is looking pretty bad. You wonder if at some point they might even call the doctor. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. These guys oh. are swinging. Wow. He's got him hurt here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Well, he's able to get back up here, but oh, man, is he on wobbly legs. And now, oh, another shot. He's hurt bad. He's in full guard here, and he's landing some nasty strikes. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Big Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. Excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. Well, you don't want to spend too much time fighting off of your back, Joe, but pretty good work here from the bottom by Gustafs. Look at that. Nice. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Tonight, good work here by DC. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Alexander Gustafs. 20 seconds left. Slides him over, and nice reversal here. Oh, there's a big shot. They go the 15-minute distance. What a fight. This is where you need really educated judges. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. The official decision is in, it resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for decision. All three judges score this contest 928. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Alexander the Mauler Gustafsson. So congratulations to Alexander Gustafsson. You know he's got the entire nation of Sweden on his back, and he rises to the occasion yet again. I really feel like when Gustafsson puts it all together, he looks like the best light heavyweight on the planet, and you've got to think just how exciting he is and how skilled a technician he is that he will eventually get that UFC gold before his career is said and done.